people ask every day, why don't you have eyelashes? Why don't you have any facial hair? You know, they ask those things. And you just get tired of answering it after a while. Joseph originally heard about my work in beard and eyebrows um, through, I believe, a fellow vet who had seen something or read something about my work with beard transplants. He contacted us as a result of, uh, or because he had lost his eyebrows and his beard uh, from a flash type injury uh, that he experienced uh, in, as, as a soldier in um, Iraq. And um, as a result, he was left without a lot of his facial hair. And, for uh, I think pretty obvious reasons, and he felt bad. On top of it all, he you know he lost these hairs as a result of serving our country, keeping us all safe. Um, so through the American Academy of Facial Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery, uh, they have a Faces of Honor program. Joseph went underwent a procedure of a little over 1,700 grafts, follicular unit extraction, which means that no incision. We took the grafts out one at a time. Then they were placed into primarily his beard, creating a nice mustache, goatee, beard, sideburns, but we also did some eyebrows, because he lost them uh, similarly to, as a result of the trauma he experienced uh, back in the war. You can see, you know, the mustache is pretty nicely filled in. We've got some pretty good filling into the goatee. Got your sideburns, basically create more than a strap beard. You know, not, not as high, you know, ideally, but you know, in some guys, but I think this, in your case, looks great. I mean, we got nice filling in there. Um, the eyebrows look great. Um, so those hairs are all going to fall out, um, and uh, they'll probably start regrowing for you, Joseph, in probably around three, four months. You'll start seeing some regrowth, and then you have to trim them, obviously, and the beard will grow the beard hairs. Thank you. So, and you don't have to do what you did. It's our pleasure. Faces of Honor program sort of lets us all feel like as a, as a group, not just me as an individual, but my whole society, my whole academy is giving back to veterans such as Joseph. And, you know, obviously he's happy, but I mean, as happy as he is, the pleasure is really ours just to feel that we're giving something back to, you know, someone that, you know, has done so much for us.